Hey Aries, and welcome to the second part of your reading, which is gonna be your advice reading. We're gonna see if there's anything else you need to know um, about what is going on with you. There's a lot going on with you at this time. So we'll see if we can get some more clarity in the situation and if there's any advice for you, okay? So let's see here, Holy Angels. What else do we need to know about the situation with Aries? Can you clarify this a little bit more for us? And um, what advice do you have here for Aries? Let's see. Two of Pentacles. So. We have the Hermit in Reverse, Four of Pentacles, and the King of Swords. So, I mean, in your last reading, it was going, um, it was a little bit about like law enforcement, an official person, or a judge, or something like that. So that's who this King of Swords could be. King of Swords can sometimes be law enforcement. Um, but with the Hermit in reverse, it, I don't know, maybe somebody doesn't want someone to look into something or they don't want something to be investigated. Um, they might be trying to also hold back information or um, keep some information from coming out. Let's see. Why is the Hermit in reverse here for Aries? Why is the Hermit in reverse here for Aries? Let's see the four of wands in reverse. Or someone could maybe even be depressed. I don't know. Sometimes the hermit in reverse is like depression, isolation, feeling very alone and lonely um, because you have the Four of Wands, Reverse, Three of Pentacles, Nine of Cups, Reverse. This is all like, especially this is some somebody that's very unhappy within themselves. Somebody that's very um, discontent. Like somebody feels unfulfilled. They feel unhappy being alone, okay? Um, somebody might not want to work together with someone anymore. There's some sort of a collaboration that's falling apart now. And somebody could feel like they're losing their stability or losing something that they've worked for. So that could be making someone depressed, feeling like something's not working out. What's the Four of Pentacles? Justice. Because of justice. Because they lied. I didn't even flip this card over before I had said they lied, but I was talking about the Knight of Swords in reverse. So somebody came in with some lies, some slander, some gossip, some cutting words, okay? Some communication that was mean and conniving, okay? This has something to do with lies and trying to get away with a large amount of money. There's a large amount of money here or some sort of generational wealth or an inheritance or something to do with a lot of money. Or something that's worth a lot okay and with the four of pentacles somebody wants to hold on to this they're trying to find a way how to hold on to this they want to they want to get away with it now why is the king of swords here ten of wands this person could be feeling very burdened right now they're trying to push through but something feels very hard yeah, they feel like they can't make a move. They cannot um, go forward with something or it's a missed opportunity. And they, re But they really want to hold on to this. Whatever this is, they really want to hold on to it. They don't want to lose it, okay? They're probably, with the Ten of Wands, they could be trying to find a way to just like push through, okay? They, they really want to carry this home no matter what the burden, no matter what the cost. They just don't want to give up, okay? But they are feeling depressed at this time or like very unhappy maybe with the results of something. So tell me more about the Hermit in Reverse. Knight of Wands. They're very unhappy about some sort of action that they took. Well, that, wasn't, that was an accident, but... With a Queen of Cups trying to get away with something here. And you have the Knight of Cups again and the Chariot. So somebody could be depressed about taking action with a Queen of Cups. Judgment. 
they're they're very depressed about the thought of them being under judgment. The Knight of Cups and the Star in Reverse and the King of Cups. Okay, there we are again. So with someone right now, or they don't want this to be investigated. So either they don't want it to be looked into, because these this is what came out in your first reading as well, right? It's some sort of a love offer or something with a King of Cups, okay? Or with the Knight of Wands. That's, I'm pretty sure that was the same card that came out with the King of Cups in the first reading as well. It's some sort of lie that they told about a love offer or a love affair or something loving and passionate between two people that was like made up in their delusional fantasy. So... This is um, what they don't want someone to look into because they don't want to be under judgment. Tell me more about the Hermit in Reverse. A community. So a community doesn't want something to be investigated because they don't want to go to jail. They feel trapped. They don't want to go to prison. They don't want to go to jail. This whole community is really fucking nervous and scared and paranoid and sad and depressed, feeling hopeless and defeated because they don't want to go to jail. Yeah. What's the Nine of Cups reverse? Okay, what's the Nine of Cups reverse? Money, money trails, money trails, nine of coins, money trails, a money investment or a long-term payment. Cause look, that's what I was getting with this four of wands as well in the first reading a little bit. It's like, I don't know if this is like a down payment on a house or some sort of a mortgage or some sort of a long, it's a long-term investment. It's something that is slow moving because that's a nine of coins. Nine of coins is slow moving energy and it's, a long-term goal right like five to ten year plan but they're depressed and unhappy about losing a home or losing some some sort of stability that they work for death yeah they about this ending about something ending for them some sort of a money investment that they made or a money plan or a money goal is ending for them and they're so unhappy about this what's the four of wands reverse A journey a journey to a courthouse so they're scared and worried that if they make a journey to a courthouse they're gonna lose something so are they so is there something going on in court behind someone's back is there something is there like a secret court case going on that someone doesn't even know about that's going on behind someone's back two of cups in reverse because of a breakup King of Wands. There's a, is there a secret court case going on? Ten of Swords, Ace of Cups. Or what is this court case? Or what is this courthouse? Six of Swords in Reverse. Emperor, is this a judge? And they feel like they can't get out of something that they did with a judge or with a courthouse? They took a journey to a courthouse. An emperor could be a judge or someone who sits in higher authority. And now they feel like they can't get out of this. And they're scared of going to jail. But why, why is there a... Why is there a secret court case going on here? How is this possible? Because of an Ace of Cups. What? Because of an Ace of Cups? How is there a court case going on here? Or how is it, how is it even possible that people here are turning in a bunch of, fu a fuck ton of fake evidence, fabricated evidence on someone, and the person that is involved in this doesn't even know what's going on? How is that even possible? Because of a king of pentacles? Or because of his body double? Or because someone is showing up to court as a body double? 
someone who has a body double. Somebody is pretending to be someone else. So that's how they were able to have a secret court case. The world and the chariot. This is how they were able to move something forward. Is there a secret court case going on with somebody that's like allegedly the king of pentacles, but it's actually their body double? Magician. Yeah, they're creating something here. They're like creating illusions here. But how does somebody not know about this? They're turning in all of this fake evidence and someone doesn't even know there's a court case going on. It's like they never were never notified. Or it's about or it's something with a wealthy man. About a wealthy man. Something changing for a wealthy man. A message in reverse. You never got a message? You never received a message. Someone never received a message? Like what? About a court case and nobody ever knew what was going on? Or what is this shit? Someone never received a message. A message about what? A main male. A main male never received a message. Never received a message about what? From a mature woman. A mature woman never gave someone a message. A mature woman never gave someone a message. What's in the message? A message about what? About some sort of money. About some sort of money and the King of Swords. Or is the King of Swords a lawyer? A mature woman never gave someone a message about money and a lawyer? Or money... Who's this King of Swords? Who's the King of Swords? A mature man in reverse. So this could be an air sign, masculine. So there's a mature woman here, a mature woman and a mature man that never gave someone a message. They never gave someone a message about something with court. Adjudication in reverse, high honor. They never gave someone a message about something with a judge because what, they didn't want someone to show up to court? A message. Wait a minute, did they? Um, so who's this mature man uh, and this mature woman? Or that's the king of swords. So they, there's something going on in court and they never told someone about this? Why? Yeah, it's the Hierophant, it's a higher institution. This could be uh, the courts or the authorities or the police. So they were they supposed to give someone a message about court? About judgment, a queen of cups. I'm pretty sure that's this mature woman. So these people could be a couple. It could be a water sign feminine and an air sign masculine. It's an older couple. These two got a message from court and they never told someone about this message or some sort of judgment or some sort of ruling. What would, that's the truth. What is, it's about family. So what was in this message? What was in this message? It was about a relationship. What was in this message with a queen of wands? 
there was a message from a court or from a judge or from the authorities regarding a large amount of money, like an inheritance, but someone never got it. Someone never got the message. And it has something to do with the Queen of Wands. No way. Wait a minute. In the past, are you telling me that in the past there was a ruling? There was a ruling in court. There was some sort of judgment in the courthouse about a large amount of money, about an inheritance or something like that. Someone never received the message about this. Someone never received this message. Someone doesn't even know what the fuck this is. And someone never received a message about this. This money, what, let me guess, went to the Queen of Wands that was committing identity fraud in someone's name. This is why they planned someone's death. Because there was no relationship there. Because of a because of a the because of a breakup. Because there was no relationship, or because somebody didn't want to make a choice, or somebody didn't want to have to share with someone the lovers. So you're telling me that there was a court ruling or some sort of a judgment or some sort of a message from the courts about a large amount of money, but someone didn't receive this message. That someone never received this message. No, they didn't. No, they didn't. Somebody lied. Somebody stole this mail, stole this message. Somebody never told someone about whatever this is. Someone didn't, someone didn't give someone the message. Someone doesn't even know what the fuck this is. That's the seven of swords. It's about money. It's about unexpected income. So somebody was supposed to give someone a message about unexpected income and they stole it and they decided to steal it. Thief. And they, deci they, they decided to steal it. Thief. This mature man and mature woman, I feel like they had some sort of a judgment ruling. Something was ruled in court. That's what I feel here because you have judgment and courthouse and it had something to do with a large amount of money and unexpected income and they decided to steal it someone never received a message about what this is about this money never someone doesn't even know what this is but you want to know what's weird is that the queen of wands shows up with the money so the same person that is connected to all of the other crimes and the bank fraud and pretending to be someone that they're not, oh, pigeon as a confirmation just now, this person is showing up with the money. So did this mature woman and mature man here lie to a judge or to the courts that they had given someone a message when they never did, and then they ended up sending it to a queen of wands that they were working together with to steal it? Or what is this shit? Yeah, you never got the message. Message of concern in reverse. Someone never received a message about any money. About anything with court. About any kind of a court date or a court appointment or court money or none of that. Someone never received this news. The world. That's what the hermit needs to look into next. Eight of pentacles. Yeah, that the hermit should, you know, work on this one next here, high priestess. That's your next job, Mr. Hermit, is to look into this one. There's something with a court. There's something with court. There's something with a judge or a judgment call and a large amount of money that was never, someone never received this message. Message, page of wands, someone never received a message. 
the Empress. Four of Swords in reverse. Because a chariot, because of a Queen of Cups Cancer energy here, felt like this was a missed opportunity or they didn't want to do this. They felt like this was a, you know, this made them upset and mopey and pouty. So a Queen of Cups and a King of Swords, a mature woman and a mature man, received a message from an official person or from a judgment, a courthouse, about some money and they never gave someone the message because they wanted to steal this okay thief and the seven of swords they decided to steal this whatever this is they never gave someone the message about this large amount of money they would rather keep it for themselves that's why death is here twice because after this amount of money, whatever this is, they decided to get someone out of the way so that they could keep it for themselves. Wow. Oh. So what does that have to do with the Queen of Wands? Why is she here? Why does she always show up when it's about a, lot, a, a large amount of money, huh? I'm so tired of seeing that fucking person in this, uh, in this kind of energy here. Um... And that's why they're all scared of going to jail. So this, so this lie that they created here about this King of Cups and this King of, uh, this Knight of Cups' love offer with this Knight of Wands, this was also a whole part of this entire scheme to cover up this large amount of money that someone received in court and never told someone else about. It's like they created an entire web around something with money, right? Just so that they wouldn't have to give somebody something or give someone a message that they were ordered to by court or by a higher authority or there was some sort of judgment that was passed. I don't know. Let's see. <clears throat> they wanted to hold on. That's what they wanted to hold on to here. Four of Pentacles. This is what they wanted to hold on to, this mature man and mature woman, was something that, that, that was ruled in court, apparently. See, that's why I love tarot, because we learn new things every single day, right? So, let's see. Who, what is it that they wanted to hold on to here, Four of Pentacles? A gift. A gift to a child. Interesting. So something was supposed to be a gift to a child and they wanted to hold on to it. Something about a journey. Something to do with someone's occupation. Look at this. Look, is this the thing in the courthouse that they were supposed, sudden wealth. So they were supposed to tell someone or give someone a message about some money and they never did. They never did. Someone has no fucking idea what this is and what this has to do with someone's occupation. Something was supposed to be a gift though. What's the seven of swords? This was court ordered, judge, justice. This was something that went through the courts. This was something that was supposed to, you know, be given someone and it, it never was. Somebody never found out about this. Concern. Now they're concerned about this. They're concerned. Why are they so concerned, huh? What is this? Knight of Swords Reverse. They're concerned because they ended up slandering someone here, okay? So in order to avoid having to give you something or um, you receiving something, they decided to slander someone here, make someone look really bad, attack someone, um, take someone apart with words, okay? This is, this is an attack, like, it could be a verbal attack, it could be a physical attack. Tell me about the Seven of Swords. Four, 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 when this card came out. 
they never gave someone the message. They stole the message. Whatever the message was about this large amount of money, they stole it. They stole it. They stole it and they never, they never gave it to someone. They never told someone about it. They never told the person that was supposed to receive something. This message never arrived. Seven, seven could be significant. Seven, you could have be born in 77. Someone could be born in 77 or somebody could be born on the 7th of the 7th. Maybe someone is born on the 7th of July. Maybe this is the person that was supposed to give someone a message about something and they never did. Okay, or 10th or 7th of the 10th. Maybe someone's born on the 7th of October. Okay, just take it how it resonates here. But someone never received a message about any money. Someone stole this message. They didn't want to give someone this message. And I'm pretty sure it's these two. Wow. How interesting, right? How greedy some people are. Talking about the Ten of Wands. People are so greedy. Yeah, they had an expectation. So these two had an expectation that they could do something really corrupt and illegal and lie to an official, okay? Or, you know, gaslight an official here so that they could hold on to whatever this is. They did something corrupt and illegal because they wanted to hold on to this money here. And it had something to do with claiming that a king of cups is someone's lover. Disgusting. Disgusting. It's like, you know what this is giving me? Like these two, had a whole scheme on the side of how to hold on to some money. So they use the King of Cups to lie, to corroborate their story. Then you have the King of Cups who had a whole uh, thing on the side of how they, they were trying to fuck you over, okay? So they had then pulled these two into their lie to corroborate their story. Then you have the Queen of Wands who had her own little story going and then she used these other people to corroborate her story. Do you get what I'm saying? It's like everybody had a win-win. Everybody had an advantage to what this entire lie was. And it all surrounds money. It's all about money. What else do we need to know about the situation here? And a child or a message. And someone's, and money. Money for a child. Money for a page of cups. Or it has something to do with news that you were supposed to receive. Maybe you were supposed to receive news. You were supposed to receive good news about money. Good news. Someone was supposed to give you good news about money. You never received this message. Never received it. Yeah, they wanted to keep you in poverty. They didn't want you to have this. They wanted you in poverty so that they could have it. Okay, like even look at this mature woman, this person's face. Doesn't it look evil? Okay, you can't even really see it, but they look, they're looking like. So you were supposed to receive good news about some sort of um, money, but you never did because you're in fucking poverty. Okay, that's how they wanted you. This is the end of the cycle. This is how the cycle is going to end. This is why they did what they did. Ten of Swords, the devil and strength. This is why they did what they did. This is why they wanted control over someone because they wanted control over this money. This is why they decided to stab someone in the back, betray someone, get someone out of the way and do everything they can to control the situation and control another human being and keep someone bound and trapped and submissive and um, down on the ground and you know kicked out and we have power and dominion over you and you are worth nothing and we're gonna stab you in the back and get you out of the way. It had something to do with money that they were supposed to tell someone about and they never told someone about it. No, they didn't. They didn't. They wanted it for themselves. This group of people. That's what they bribed them with. This is what they that this is what they bribed this group of people with in secret. That's the truth. They promised this group of people, hey, if you all help us with this fat ass lie, so that and, and also if you help us with this hit on this person, helping us get this person out of the way, we'll all give you a little slice of whatever this is, okay? We just need your help in getting this person out of the way. That's so sick, man. And God said, not today, look at that. Ace of coins and temperance, God said, we saw you. 
temperance angel balance is going to be restored for this you're going to receive what you were supposed to receive whatever was ordered in a court of law okay that you receive this money you're going to receive this money don't even worry about it you don't even know what this is you don't even you don't even know what this is but spirit says you're going to receive it because you were supposed to this was supposed to go to you whatever this is it was supposed to go to you it never went to you you never even heard about it you didn't even get the message Nobody ever told you about the message. Nobody told you that there's something in court. Nobody told you about a court date. Nobody gave you a message about not, nada, 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 nada. What they did do, though, is try to get you out of the way, stab you in the back, and get rid of you so that they can keep it to themselves. So I feel like that's your advice. That's your advice. Your, this could be a, your mother could have had to, well, maybe it's your own mother. This person was supposed to give you a message. They never gave you a fucking message. They never did. And I feel like this is your advice, Aries. You're gonna get whatever you were supposed to get. It's gonna be made fair and just, and it's gonna be made balanced the way that it was meant to be balanced, okay? Anything else Aries needs to know here? They stole it. Seven of Swords, they stole it. They lied and they were gonna steal it. Whatever this is, who knows? They stole it though. They were going to steal it. They wanted to steal it. They lied about it. They never told someone about it. They wanted to get away with it. They wanted to have it all to themselves. Okay? That's the truth. That's the truth. Knight of Swords. That is the truth. That's the truth. Knight of Swords. And now, and, and this has something to do with a home and a king of pentacles. This could be a family home. Maybe this was something like a family home. Like maybe this King of Pentacles is someone that passed away. This is what they never told you about. Wow. This is what they never told you about. This is what they never told you about. Someone's death. This might be something that was left to you after someone died and they never told you about it. Wow, a bird just flew by, a pigeon. See, This could be your own Passover loved one that's bringing this out to the light of day because they know what these people did to, to keep this from you. To try and get away with this. They wanted to get away with this using a King of Cups. They used the King of Cups to get away with this and this is the tower. This is, the, it's, a, it's a home, it's a family home. Three, three, two, two on the clock when this came out. There's something about a family home. There's something about a passed over loved one. Um, and you were supposed to receive something you never did. You don't even know about this. You might not even know which house this is or what it is. But you were supposed to receive something or a message and you never received it. You never received it. You never got this message. And they used a whole group of people to um, hide this from you and steal this. All right, Aries. Let's see who's involved in this for you. August, Capricorn. Your in-laws could be involved or someone in-law, maybe someone in-law. You could be dealing with a Libra. Somebody, some, somebody could have an accomplice that's born in March or born in June. Something could have happened in March, maybe, or in June. Something with a Pisces. Pisces and a Cancer. So this King of Cups could be a Pisces or a Cancer. 
Your neighbor could be involved in this. Your neighbor could know something about this. Military, November, or somebody's name starts with the letter N. Police, the police could be involved in this. A Virgo. Someone's husband, and there you are, Aries, and a baby mama. And December, and an investigator. And again, October child. So the, the child that was supposed to receive something, this person could be born in October, okay? Or you're the child that was supposed to receive something and someone born in October is trying to steal it from you. All right, guys, I'm going to leave it at that. Thanks for watching, and then I will see you on the next one. Bye.